Hi, it's Jeff Simons coming back at you again, giving you the tips that you're gonna need to have a great race at this year's Subaru Ironman Canada. So, what is the Ironman all about? So for me, uh, Ironman is all about those moments of adversity. Those are moments where something happens to you and you're faced with two choices. One, you can either quit or you can keep going. And it's best if right now you start preparing for those moments. Those moments might be something technical, they might be something with equipment. So make sure you're really thinking about some of the worst case scenarios and how you want to respond in those situations. What happens if your goggles come off? What happens if you just have a terrible, terrible swim? What happens if you get a flat tire on the bike or a mechanical on the bike? What if you drop a bottle in an A station? Start thinking about these scenarios so that when they happen in race day, you you can overcome them. I can't feel my legs! <laughs> but also start preparing for that inevitable moment where you're out on the run and your mind is just screaming at you and your body's screaming at you too and saying, you know what? You know what, Jeff? You can just slow down. Second place is pretty good too. And you got to find that mental strength to be like, no, I'm going for it. I'm doing whatever it takes to get me to that finish line. Do that now. Find those answers now so that you're more likely to have the response on race day. And if you are able to come up with those response when you're tired, when you're low on blood sugar, when things are just totally getting ugly there, that is what the Ironman's about. You're gonna feel like a champ and you're gonna get this feeling of empowerment at the finish line that makes you feel like you can do anything in the world pretty much. You can fly a plane, do it. I probably shouldn't fly a plane, but at the end of an Ironman, I sure feel like I can. So I look forward to seeing everyone at the finish line of Subaru Ironman Canada. It's an epic feeling and just remember, the more adversity you face, the sweeter that finish line feels.